Hey cousins, it's Kemi. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And today we are going shopping. We're currently in Westwood right now, so let's go. Started as an East Coast vibe, now I'm going worldwide. We got this bitch going crazy. I used to take the monster for a drive, now I'm on the 405, like it's fuck you, pain. We really sick of standing outside, had to push them all aside. It's what you get for trying to. Guys, I don't know if you can hear me, but do not come here. This place. The food is so salty, it's actually nasty. I bet they make a movie when I die just to talk about my life. They need an actor to portray me. I got some motherfucker clear like I think this. I'm in love with that one. Yeah. Because this fits your everyday and also the way things. Oh, don't do this to me. Jamie is fat. Oh, yeah. Gotta go. I'm doing. Jamie. Especially after Harry, I'm like, oh. Well, it wasn't. It's about time the kids buzzing. I'm trying to get a peek in the elevator. But if we're coming on the six, seven. Six, seven to see. Thank you so much. Thank you. This game. Thank you. Take care. Thank you so much. Doing anything to get that spot for. Started as an East Coast, Thank you. now I'm going worldwide, we got this bitch going crazy. I used to take the monster for a drive, now I'm on the 405, like it's fuck Thank you, you so much. We really sick of standing outside, had to push them all aside, it's what you get for trying to play. I bet they make a movie when I die, just to talk about my life, they need an actor to portray. I ain't settling for nothing that be under an M. There's only one of me, there's a hundred of them. Gotta listen close, I drop hundreds of I can't find anything. I need to find some black jeans. Because my black jeans are like washed out. And I need a good quality one. This is why I do not like coming in store to buy stuff. I prefer um, online shopping. We're trying another food court because the first food that we had was absolutely crap. It was so salty that we couldn't even eat it. But the blessings came to me when I opened my mind. I was running around the city, man. I knew I had to make some. Was Guys, we have shopped and we are tired. Oh my god, I had so much anxiety shopping. I do not like physical shopping anymore. I'm not gonna lie to you, that was the most traumatic experience I've had. Actually, not, let me not be a drama queen, but I don't think I like physical shopping. Level of anxiety I had, baby, I just wanted to get out. I was not comfortable vlogging from people. Oh my god, I was just like, get me home now. Hey guys, so I am back home now. I have not shopped physically in store since the pandemic, so today was actually. A lot for your girl it was a little bit overwhelming for me i was so anxious like with those so many people but we got through the day vlogging in public is actually a lot harder than what these vloggers make it out to be so shout out to all the vloggers out there because i don't know how y'all do it but you guys are doing it okay so you know you know go through some stuff that i got so i'm gonna start off with h&m i didn't really get much from h&m i just got black jeans because I was in need of black jeans. Like all my black jeans are, has turned grey. I've legit ripped out my black jeans. So I picked up two pairs of black jeans. You guys know that I recently just got rid of a lot of stuff from my wardrobe. Like I decluttered my wardrobe. So I need to start shopping some basic pieces back in there. So a pair of black jeans is a must i am rebuilding my wardrobe so you know I, I still need to get i still need to get a lot of more basic pieces and then the next thing i got from h&m was this long sleeve black top and it has like a square cut out at the front again another basic pieces obviously this is not for now this is going to be for you know when the weather starts to change and like when it starts to get a bit colder but i just didn't have anything that's long sleeve now because again i got rid of my wardrobe so i have legit no clothes so i'm legit just building it up again like i just said i also got this cute earrings from h&m as well they look super cute i love hoop earrings and this one just looks super cute next is zara again i've got some basic pieces 
um, from Zara. By the way, the Q in Zara is disgusting. I just have these already bought because your girl's gone a bit fatter. So I needed to size up in all my basic pieces. I just got a basic bodysuit. I got it in black, had to get it in white. Then I got it in this pink color as well. Again, three basic pieces that you need. And you know, Zara has good quality, so it will last for a while. Next, I went into Charlotte Tilbury. I only got two things from here. I got the Hollywood Flawless Filter. Everyone seems to love this product and they rave on about it so much, so I had to get it. I could have got it online, but I was skeptical about the shade, but when I saw it in store, it looked like it will match me, so... I picked up and because I legit just bought the elf one and I wanted to do it different because everyone says the elf one is a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury one and I didn't have the Charlotte Tilbury one to compare it with so I thought it would be a good idea for me to pick up the Charlotte Tilbury one so then that way I can do a side by side comparison and then the next one I got from Charlotte Tilbury was this glow toner I believe this is part of their new product so I thought let me give it a try because everyone loved this and my boyfriend actually picked this one up he was just like oh just get it I was like, what do you know about Tony? She was like, she said it's good, just get it. So I was like, okay, fine, I'll get it. <laughs> Next, we got boots. I picked up the Kiali perfume. This is the juicy apple one. I smelled it in store, it smells beautiful. I wanted to smell the vanilla one, but unfortunately they didn't have the test out of it or in store either. A lot of the Kiali products was actually so little. This one was left, and I believe this was the last one of this scent. So I just picked it up just to join the hype. Not really much about it. But I must say this smells really, really good. And you guys know that I'm currently building my perfume collection, so I thought I would get this as well. Next, I finally got the Fenty Fat Water Toner. Again, another cult favorite, so I had to get it. I will be trying this out soon, so I'll let you guys know how well this works. I also picked up the Fenty Skin Butter Drop um, Cream. This is a body cream I saw. Mena, Mena was talking about this in one of her videos and she seems to love this. And whatever Mena says she loves, I have to try because she will never stay you wrong. It's because I didn't have anything other than makeup from Fenty, so I thought I'll give the skincare a try and I'll also give the body care a try as well. I also picked up something for you guys. I will let you guys know at the end of the video. It will be this week's giveaway, so stay tuned. Okay, so on to the big splurges now. I got myself a coach bag, shout out to my boyfriend. This little had two in store and one of it was a display and I got my hands on the new one. Let me show you guys this beauty right here. Cousins, look at this bag. Isn't she cute? I got this for like an everyday wear. Like, look at it. It's just so cute and it fits everything in there. It comes obviously with a strap. Unfortunately, the straps are not changeable. I've done the fit and test in there to see if it will fit my items, my everyday items, and it did. But I absolutely love this bag. This bag is just so me. And I love that. And then finally, we've got our Gucci bag. This was the main reason why we actually went shopping. Honestly, the lady at Gucci was so lovely. Her name's Sarah. She was just so kind and so friendly. Like, she's just so adorable. And whenever I need something from Gucci, she's gonna be the person I go to. This is the bag. It comes with a gold strap. You can wear it as a shoulder bag, a cross bag, and you can also wear it as a clutch as well. I wanted a practical bag that I can actually put my stuff in. You guys know that I like small, dainty bags, but I wanted a bag that's also functional that I can actually put stuff in. So I thought this bag was just perfect for me. It comes with two compartments as well, as well, so you have lots of room. If you feel like this size is too big for you, they do have a smaller size of this. I thought this was just perfect because it fits everything that I need. It's just a classic bag to have. You can dress it up, you can dress it down, wherever you like. It's just such a cute, functional bag. Obviously, I could not go shopping and forget my cousins. That would be rude of me. Like, no, I had to get you guys something too, obviously. So I've got one of you guys, this YSL Libre perfume. This is gonna be this week's giveaway present. So if you guys are interested on winning this perfume right here, all you have to do is obviously be subscribed to my channel, like and comment on this video and any other video that I post between today till the 7th of 
August. So this is pretty much it for today's video cousins. Thank you guys so much for coming shopping with me. It was a lot. I don't think I'll be doing it again. <laughs> I think I'll stick to online shopping because my anxiety level was killing me, okay? But it was fun, honestly. I had my boyfriend with me, it was fun. I just need to be more comfortable, you know, vlogging. But it's fine, I enjoyed it. I like the fact that I pushed through and hopefully I'll do more videos. Thank you cousins so much for watching. I love you guys so much and inshallah, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye, I need to go to bed and take off this makeup because I can't work in the morning, bye.